Hello everybody. Welcome to other English lesson. This time we are going to talk about past progressive. Look at the picture. The driver says, But I wasn't texting, sir. I was surfing the net. The driver is giving his version of what he was doing when he was stopped by the police officer. You see, past progressive puts emphasis on the course of an action in the past. Let's continue with past progressive charts. In order to make affirmative statements, you must write first the subject plus verb to be plus base form of the verb plus ing. I mean gerund. Okay? Plus complement if it is needed. Examples. I was speaking English. She was speaking English. Or we were speaking English. They were speaking English. In order to make negative statements, you must write first the subject, the verb to be, plus not, plus gerund, plus complement. Examples. I was not speaking English. She was not speaking English. We were not speaking English. They were not speaking English. We can use the short forms. For example, wasn't instead of was not or weren't instead of were not. In order to make yes no questions, you must write first the verb to be plus subject plus base form of the verb plus ing or gerund plus complement plus question mark. Examples. Was he speaking English? Was she speaking English? Were you speaking English? Were they speaking English? Short answers are Affirmative. Yes, he was. Yes, she was. Yes, we were. Yes, they were. In a negative form, we have No, he wasn't. No, she wasn't. No, we weren't. No, they weren't. Finally, in order to make WH questions or information questions, you must write first the WH word plus verb to be plus subject plus gerund plus complement plus question mark. For example, why was he speaking English? Why was she speaking English? Why were you speaking English? Why were they speaking English? And let's continue with explanations. Number one, use the past progressive to describe an action that was in progress at a specific time in the past. The action began before the specific time. You see, this is the specific time. And may or may not continue after the specific time. For example, What were you doing at two o'clock? We were working at home. I was eating lunch at two o'clock. Here, the specific time in the past is two o'clock. They began with the action before two o'clock and may or may not continue after that specific time. Be careful, non-action verbs are not usually used in progressive. For a list of common non-action verbs, you can go to the description section. I posted a link for you. For example, I had a headache last night. I cannot say I was having a headache last night because having is a non-action verb. It means possession. 
Okay, explanation number two. Use the past progressive with while to talk about two actions in progress at the same time in the past. Use the past progressive in both clauses. For example, was reading, was cooking. Two actions that they started before and a specific time in the past. While I was reading, she was cooking dinner. She was cooking dinner while I was reading. Usage note. In informal conversation, some people use when with the past progressive. For example, Sorry, I wasn't listening when you were talking. Okay, explanation number three. Use the past progressive to focus on the duration of an action, not its completion, and use the simple past tense to focus on the completion of an action. You get it? For example, Richard was working on a project last night. Here, we don't know if Richard finished the project because it focuses on the duration of an action. Richard worked on a project last night. Here, he probably finished the project because it focuses on the completion of an action. Now, time to practice. Choose the correct option. Why did you disagree with me at the meeting? To make me look incompetent? Option A, did you try? B, did you try? C, were you trying? D, was you trying? Yes, C is the correct option. Were you trying? Because it refers to a duration of an action, not its completion. Why did you disagree with me at the meeting? Were you trying to make me look incompetent? Choose the correct option. Last night I, mm, on my thesis, and it took me a while to realize that my phone was ringing. Option A, worked. B, was working. C. Work. D. Were working. Yes, B is the correct option. Was working. Because here we are talking about two actions in progress at the same time in the past. Was working on my thesis and the phone was ringing. Last night I was working on my thesis and it took me a while to realize that my phone was ringing. Find the mistake. Leo was drying the dishes when he was dropping the plate. Yes, the mistake is on letter D. Was dropping should be dropped because it refers to a completion of an action. Leo was drying the dishes when he dropped the plate. Please remember to like this video if you find it useful. Share it with your friends and colleagues learning English. And remember to subscribe to my channel for more free English videos each week. Thank you for watching. Thank you.